Look at the spots on that thing. Look at the size and the beauty of that fish. I'm gonna let it revive a long time. It fought so hard. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here on the Blackfeet Reservation fishing a beautiful lake called Dog Gun. We've heard there's some beautiful trout in here. Stick around, we're gonna go after them. I think it'll be a great show. Fish, oh All it's right, a big nice. one too. It's a big fish. Just minutes on the lake and I was into a big fish. I see it flashing. The fish is pulling hard. It's gone. Ah. Oh, golly. That was a big fish, folks. Got right out here at Dog Gun Lake here in Montana. Just started fishing about 10 minutes ago. That was a big trout and it is gone. Dang it. And about where's your indicator? I'm about five feet. Okay. Maybe, you so know, five and a half. So you're probably a little half. higher than I am then. It was in the morning and my indicator went down and I set the hook. And sure enough, you had the telltale shake and it was a nice fish. All right. Good job. Thank you. There she goes. I was keeping steady pressure on the trout. Yeah. Oh boy. There she goes. Hard fighters. Hard fighting fish. Wow. Oh boy. These fish in this lake are so nice. Not that I've actually landed one. Oh yeah, it's a beautiful bow, guys. Awesome. Woo. The tension was building as I reached to grab the net. Oh boy, I don't know if he's ready. Oh boy, gorgeous. Nice oh, trout. Baby. Oh my god. Wow, that's, that's a big fish. Huge rainbow. Whew. Which fly, lad? Can you tell? It's a leech. Okay, good. Mongo rainbow. Okay. Is that net Go. gonna drop? That net's yep, going to the bottom. That's okay. Look at this beautiful, beautiful mm. trout. Oh my gosh. Isn't that gorgeous? Mm-hmm. Wow, I'm telling you, that was a heck of a fish. <laughs> oh boy, I don't know what to say. It's just, I had a couple on, I had one on that, yeah. that's that big or maybe even bigger the way it flies. Yeah, I had one on briefly that was heavy too. Yeah, shoot. On the leech, you wanna show the leech real quick? Yeah. I might uh, switch over to that brown, you've gotten a lot more hits. Okay, this is a fly that Guy David Parsons uh, gave us on the Blackfeet Reservation here. Mm -hmm. And it's a heck of a fly, and it worked again. And you're just about five feet under your strike indicator, five yep. or six feet? Yep, five or six feet under the strike indicator. Okay. And uh, good fish. Awesome, good job. Thanks. Get some more. All right, will do. I was about to release the big fish, and I want to keep it in the water. I thought the net would float, but it doesn't. Swim? Uh, you're not going to see anything down there, my well, gosh. It's, it's right straight down. Yeah, but it's whatever. Oh, I see it. I see it right now. Maybe I should leave my shirt on just because of the leech factor. No, you want to see them. Yeah, if oh. they get under there and you can't see them, you want to see them. If they get on you, they just pull off. It's they not a big deal. Off. I've had them on me. They just pull off. There's no diseases. <laughs> I'm a little more worried about hypothermia than... Yeah. I dove into the leech infested lake. I can't see nothing. I can't see nothing. 
Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Here it comes. Yes. Grab it. Yes. Oh. Oh. Yes. Oh. <laughs> There's got to be a lesson in here somewhere. And I'm thinking it might be to either tie your net onto the boat or get an actual net that floats. That would be good. <sighs> yeah, you seemed a little shocked by it. Yeah. It sucks because they go down to the bottom and I'm just freeze and I can't see anything and it's just freaky. Yeah. You know, there's leeches in there. <laughs> That was a fish. Okay, well that, that and that is a fish. Awesome. And it's a beautiful one too. Another big trout. Wow. These fish, this fish in this lake are just phenomenal. Line management's very important. Wish I had some. <laughs> uh, gosh, these are just hard fighting dog dog down fish. That's awesome. Oh boy, it's another big trout. Looks about the same size as the last one. Can you see which fly he's on? I can't yet. That was kind of weird looking. Huh. Could be, a, well, I don't know if there's browns in here. Shoot, it took all my flies. <laughs> what? Yes. So I missed two already. Oop. Shoot. You're okay. Oop, no, you're not. Oh, gosh, dang it. Thank okay. you. Yeah. What a circus. <laughs> yeah, today's been quite the circus. Yeah, it right? has. <laughs> More than usual. Yeah, more than usual is right. I'm just having fun. <laughs> Pulling you is. <laughs> Holy smokes, there he goes. <laughs> yeah, that's full power. <laughs> Jeez. Disaster. Oh man, I almost lost my sweats. There's no way I'm gonna hold. Come on, fishy fish. Fish, boy. All right. Called Hold that one in. right in. Nice. Ah. Dang, got it. Shoot. Did he break me off? All broken? One, I, I lost one. Mm. It's on the bottom leech. There's one. All right, Steve. Woo! Yeah. It went down. Yes. Looks like a good one, too. Yes, taking line. Holy smoke. It's taking line. Wow. It's such a great feeling when the strike indicator goes down. You set the hook and you feel the pull and shake of a big fish. Awesome. Yeah, it feels like a good fish. Oh man. yeah. The way it's peeling out line. Steve cranked hard on the reel to get some line back. I'd coach you, but I'm right in the middle of tying a knot. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, I could see him. Yeah, he's flashing good. It's a nice it's fish. Big. I don't know, it's about the same, I think. Wow, what nice a gorgeous fish. trout. Yes, it is. Oh yeah. Nice. Holy it's about smokes. like the one you caught. It's a that, nice fat fish. That is huge. Yeah, it is. Absolutely huge. Oh, 
That's, That's a, a gorgeous fat one. fish. Yeah. Unbelievable. Wow. That is a big fish. That's the biggest fish of the trip for me. I think maybe six pounds. Yeah. Wow. What a gorgeous trout. Oh, man. That was a big, fat, hard fighting fish. That was awesome. He took out, I don't know how many yards of line on the initial run. Got him back, got him in. That was awesome. On the Blackfeet Reservation, we have also fished Four Horns Lake with guide David Parsons. Here, we caught huge bows Look on dry flies. The size of that thing. Yeah. And we fished Goose Lake for large cutthroat. Beautiful. David also took us to Mission Lake for some hard fighting rainbows and browns. Ah! Wow! Nice, what a jump. Fish. Oh, nice. Feels like. Like they always do, big. Yeah, there's nice sized fish here. This thing is hidden far away. It's still going, what do I do? Just, well, you got lots of line. I mean. It's gonna, it's gonna be halfway across the lake. I slowly managed to gain some ground back. Still haven't seen him yet. Looks like a monster. It is, it's huge. I finally had the fish in my sights, but it was being stubborn. Come on, big guy. Come on, big wow. guy. Wow. Come on up, big guy. Come on. Awesome. Watch your anchor rope. Got it. Got it. Nice. Oh my God. Yes. It's in. Awesome. Oh. My gosh, it's big. Holy smokes. Oh, wow. Look at the spots on that thing. Look at the size and the beauty of that fish. I'm going to let it revive a long time. It fought so hard. I love this lake, Doggone Lake. The Blackfeet Reservation. Every fish we caught has been monsters. That fish was huge. It was. Yes. That fish was big. It was a monster fish. And uh, it's exciting. I've had two or three break off. They could be just as big. I hope they're not. That thing was scary. It was like Moby Dick. Oh. And the net did not go to the bottom of the lake. Nice job. The tip of the week is brought to you by Northwest Outfitters, located at the village at Riverstone in Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. So one thing to think about as you're swinging through a run is your angle of cast. Depending on the setup you have, whether it's a sink tip or weighted fly setup, and the current speed really will dictate what angle your cast is. It really helps when you can start visualizing what your fly is doing as it's coming across. Since we're kind of trying to reach out into this faster water, but have a nice soft bucket in between, I really don't want to cast 90 degrees 
or my fly is gonna hang up in the rocks before it even starts to swing. This is where I want to cast farther downstream, put tension on the fly sooner, and that will allow the fly to come across through some of the slower water without hanging up. Fish, all right. Talking about the next fish. I strip my line to keep the pressure on. Going straight down, but there he goes. Is he gone? Shoot! Darn it! Another big one? It was another big one, yeah, it was a monster. I have a strike indicator and leech is hanging down six feet below that. And these leeches have rubber tails on them that when the waves bob up and down with the strike indicator, it moves those tails and entices the fish. Steve, why are you holding your hat like that? Because my lips are burned. Oh, I missed a fish. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No, I'm not kidding. Good heavens. Talk gun it. That is just crazy. I look back and it's three inches under the water. That is just insane. There's one. Yeah. Nice. Thanks. Oh, I can see him. I would ask if it's a good one, but I think I know the answer to it. Yeah, no doubt. Wow, he's going towards shore. Oh my god! Yeah, it came up, splashed. Oh, that thing's huge! Woo, dogs! Come on, Steve. Oh, I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, they're just nice fish in here. They're humongous. Every fish we've caught. The large trout was showing no intentions of giving up as Steve was applying steady pressure. Wow, beautiful colors. Oh boy, it's huge. Man, it is. It's another fatty. Got him. Ah. Yeah, I got him. That is a monstrous trout. It might be about the same as the last one, but it's a good six, seven pounds. Oh man, that is just crazy. That's two fish, six to eight pounds, somewhere in there. I, it's just hard to tell, but I haven't caught a lot of fish today, but the ones I've caught have been monsters and it's been awesome. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this show from Dog Gun Lake. I know we had a great time, caught a lot of beautiful fish. Please join us next week for more Fishing with Ladden. Hey folks, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.